Welcome to another Helix Video Solutions. Today I'm going to show you how you can configure a custom status recent value so they are available in SmartIT. So I'm here in the in Developer Studio. You can see I have the ASD Attributes form. I went to Form, I clicked on Create View Overlay, and the form became with an overlay. Now I, I selected the status recent field and I gave it an over, over, overlay type of overwrite and you can see the selection list. If I click on the ellipsis button, you can see that I have my um, custom uh, status recent value. So if we head back to ITSM in mid-tier, you can see that the value is already showing up here. The second prerequisite that we needed to have was going into the sys status recent menu items form and we need to create a record. I selected the form to be base element. I just gave it a random character field uh, value. I give it my name and the menu order doesn't matter if I select zero. This uh, will be putting this to no and the menu visible to yes. So I'm heading over back to developer studio because I already had created the ASD attributes record and I saved the form ASD base element automatically became with an overlay and then you can see that the value is already present. Now at this point it would be a good idea to run the Sync UI utility with, uh, in asset management so that you can sync the changes. Now here in the AST computer system uh, form you can see that the status is, uh, is, is saying that it's deployed but the status reason is now showing me the custom value. So these are all the steps that you need. Thank you. Please subscribe to our channel for more.